How old are you? I'm 21. Do you have a car? Yes, I do. Would you date a man who didn't have one? Absolutely. Who gives a fuck about any of that shit, genuinely? Who gives a fuck? No one gives a fuck what you drive. See, I like the way you think, woman, lady. You know what I'm saying? I like the way you think, but you know, you say who gives a F? Black people, unfortunately. Unfortunately, black women think that you need to be driving a Bugatti in order to be in a relationship with her. Black women care. The most single women on the planet. Let's keep it going. Don't give a fuck what you wear. If you're a good person and if you're the right fucking dude, you'll find the right fucking guy. I mean, women. See, see, but so many of our people are caught up in the limelight and the thought of materialism just invades their mind so much that it clouds their judgment. You understand what I'm saying? So basically what I'm getting at is this. First of all, what we're doing is not enough. Let me just say that. What we're doing is not enough. What we're doing is not enough for us to secure a, 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 a great relationship. Let me just say that. You know what I'm saying? So even though this woman is giving prime advice, right? A lot of women is just going to bypass that, right? Even though Be Becky and Marisol, just like my man Kevin Samuel said, don't have a problem with finding a husband or marrying a husband, right? At a much higher rate than the black community, right? Or the Moorish community, right? Whatever you want to call yourself, right? They still going to look at her like, oh my God, da -da 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 -da. And then point the finger when the black man wants to date the white woman. And it's just like, that's who they love. Don't blame them for dating this type of person. When you yourself are a judgmental person and you just looking to be uh, 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 an opportunist. You know what I'm saying? This woman is not an opportunist. She's got her mind. She's got her head on her shoulders. And most of y'all got your head up y'all. You feel me? Hold on. So if you met a man out here and then he told you, yo, I don't have a whip, you'd still want to take it I further? I say you need a ride to the airport? I got you. You pick him up for the first day too? Of course. If I made 50K, would that be enough for you? No girl that actually gives a shit, gives a fuck about how much you make a year. Except the ones with a broke mindset. The ones who are not intending on being wise. The ones who don't intend on establishing a relationship past five minutes. You see what I'm saying? So the ones who are material driven are the ones that care about everything you wearing, everything you got. You know what I'm saying? They, can, they Basically what I'm getting at is this. They care only because the next mother care. You feel me? So they're not even trying to please themselves. They're trying to please their friends. Because they friends said it was cool. Because they friends listen to artists that say, oh, I'm driving in the latest Bugatti. You feel what I'm saying? Or I'm driving in a, a cyber truck. On oh, God. Say I'm lying. They listen to people that say they driving in these things. And so they value or prioritize these things and these things only. You see? Not relationships, but they prioritize these things. You see what I'm saying? So that's what the relationship is all based on. Things, materials, not actual love, but things. So why do so many women make money the main point? Because they're not the one. Your wife doesn't give a shit about how much you make a year. Let me tell you. So you think you're a wifey? I'm wifey for the right man. But honestly, to all you single men out there, if you're tripping about how much you make, don't worry about it because the right girl is not going to give a shit because she's going to like you because you're an awesome person. So basically, if the woman that you dating does not have as much optimism as this woman does, red flags should be going up in your head. Red flags until you see six flags. Oh, God. Nigga, don't, don't, hey, brother, don't sit around and wait on somebody, you know what I'm saying? Don't, don't judge a book by their cover is basically what I'm saying. 
don't be looking for a baddie that's looking for to, to empty your pockets, dog. That's where y'all get it get it wrong at. You know what I'm saying? You prioritizing looks over characteristics. You feel me? And that's why your relationship is garbage already. Like I said, avoid women that do not have optimism in their mind. On God. Avoid women that's worried about where you working at, how much you making, what you act. Avoid them at all costs. You see? At all costs. Because it's going to cost you in the long run. How old are you? <laughs>